so today we are trying to uninstall the older version of ANSYS so where you can uninstall this you have to go to your program files wherever the ANSYS is installed say for example 2021 you will see uninstall option that you have to click so I already processed this one so that's why you can see uh, it shows So message will appear on the below side. Okay, so an installation complete. Please review the above information. So this was ANSYS 2021 release one version which was available uh, in my laptop. Now we are shifting to the new version because uh, few days back ANSYS has released 2022 version. So I'm going to install that. How to install that? Uh, so for this you need to go to the website official website of ANSYS you can enter on the Google that is student version so we'll just try to show you how it can be done so on your browser uh, enter go to the Google so click on ANSYS student version so you click on this uh, in this uh, option you will be having the download now so now uh, in sys student 2022 release 1 this version is available uh, slightly more uh, size you require so this is <coughs> latest version which is available so total we already downloaded this version so this one will show you in the folder so approximately the file is of 8.06 GB so first of all this will be a zip file I need to extract this over here so we'll extract here itself can take some time so easily you can get uh, this uh, version so how much time you can use it you can use it for one year so again that license is also renewable one so no need to go for the crack version it's the best way to go with the student version which is available there are some limitations as far as the student version like uh, as far as the structural analysis we are doing so 128,000 nodes and element we can do with in case of the fluid flow friend we can go up to 5 lakh 12 uh, we can say thousand cells and node so these are a few things that need to be remember uh, one more important thing uh, regarding your uh, we can say the compatibility if you are considering with the requirements say Microsoft Windows 10 then uh, how many parallel uh, you can or we can say high performance computing so this is applicable just up to two cores as far as the student version is concerned but if you are going with the other version maybe academics or enterprise you may have some variations over there so as far as the student are been concerned you are just limited to two cores so this speed will be limited as far as the student version has been concerned now let's check I guess uh, extraction has completed so once this has been extracted you will see setup window setup option available click over here just click as run as an administrator you have to do this over here So this was uh, website so you have to click on this run as administrator make it run and uh, one process will start with this process you are going to install 
the Ansys Academic 2022 release one make it next uh, definitely the user interface was quite better in 2021 release 2 so in 2022 release 1 it could be quite better than the earlier one so this could take time uh, depending on your system configuration So estimated time it shows uh, around two minutes, uh, but it can take uh, quite a bit more time than this. So this is Somewhere around 66% it has completed now. So only 16 seconds are left. I will check what is new in this uh, 2022 release one. The interface will be quite better than uh, the one 2021 because the pre the earlier one which I was using was 2021 release one. So after that, 2021 release two was also there, but uh, I haven't installed that. Uh, so we'll check it. Uh, but I have used this on some another laptop. So uh, based upon that, uh, user interface was quite better in 2021 release two. I uh, hope to see some more improvements uh, in 2022 release 1. <clears throat> it is almost completed 98%. Okay, so this is uh, has been completed. You can now click on exit here so just click on workbench now 
2022 release 1 a new window will open just see what uh, <coughs> difference we have okay so make it okay so a quite similar user interface not much of the changes but in case of uh, okay so geometry and other things these are there so I'll just open with uh, some fluid flow fluent we'll just check any significant changes are there in design modeler or not as compared to 2021 release 2 so no such uh, major changes uh, you can see the similar uh, user interface window uh, I will just try to create one primitive so that uh, what happens in the other part may be meshing part what happens I'll just try to check out how it is visible there so we'll just move to the next part that is meshing we'll check any other changes are there here so design modeler is quite uh, similar uh, with the one which we have 2021 release 1 and release 2 and 2022 release 1 A simple geometry we have prepared just to check uh, regarding the user interface of uh, all these things like uh, setup and other so this is again a uh, quite similar user interface the one which is observed in the earlier one so I will just try to proceed this one we'll make it update and we'll proceed for yeah the next part I am just checking here how uh, things are visible in the latter part I will just check it out with how many processes I can run whether I am able to run the four processes or not here Uh, there is one uh, thing which uh, we have observed uh, not sure about uh, the reason behind it but uh, unless and until you don't have the internet connection uh, uh, previously it was not starting with the 2021 release one version I'm not uh, sure I'm not uh, aware of the reason behind it but as uh, at the same time here also it is taking some time to load just check it out whether if I started my internet connection and then I'm checking back whether it will start over there or not okay it was showing fail to start when it was not connected to internet I have connected now I guess this will start now yeah it is coming so uh, we'll see whether any major changes are there in case of your uh, fluent window because uh, here is the portion where we are likely to see some changes in case of uh, the object which have been kept so it's quite a uh, similar layout which uh, was there in case of 2021 release 1 not much of the changes which you can have 